So far in this course, you've only had great conversations. Having good chats is all about the goal and the context. In this video, we'll have a bad chat. Let's go! I love Barcelona. It is one of my favorite cities in the world. The architecture, the beach, the vibe, everything is just sublime. Let me ask ChatGPT, why is Barcelona so good? ChatGPT replied with, Barcelona, more specifically, the football club Barcelona. Wow, wait, what a bad reply. This has nothing to do with what I wanted to achieve. I mean, Barcelona, the city. There you have it. Architecture, culture, and so on. This is a prime example of really bad prompting. People are guilty of it all the time. This is also the prime reason why people don't find ChatGPT useful. By the way, I'll rename this conversation and add a prohibited emoji to signify we had a bad, bad chat. Let's try this one more time. Why is the city of Barcelona so good? I really love the architecture and urban planning. The results are much better, aren't they? Yes, because we provided a bit more context. But can we level this up even more? A bulletproof technique is to create two separate sections for your prompt. One is context and the other is goal. Just by using the word context, I feel obliged to write a whole story. I've been to Barcelona several times as a tourist. I absolutely love the architecture, urban planning, beaches, people and the overall vibe. Everything about it is absolutely mesmerizing. Goal. I would like to learn a bit more about the reasons why Barcelona has developed into such an amazing city compared to other cities. Here, have a read. The result is amazing. Exactly what I wanted. Because I provided so much more information. Context, that is. I'll rename this conversation and save it to favorites. Let's recap. If you use ChatGPT like Google with five word questions, you will have a bad time. If you provide the context and the goal you're trying to achieve, you get very useful results. The general rule is the more information you provide, the better. Since humans are lazy, we want to spend less time prompting, right? Well, in the next few lectures, we will explore some great ways to provide a lot of context with very few words. Thank you for watching.